back with another brilliant D-Link unboxing. I'm Sophie, I do PR for D-Link. I'm Alan Jones, I'm Head of Consumer Solutions here in the UK. Yay, and today we're gonna to talk about some home consumery, cool little gadgets that we thought we'd talk you through. Um, so yeah, so we've got some. Um, we've got a few devices here that we're going to talk through, which um, will help help to improve your remote working experience. Um, so we're going to start off with. Can we start uh, with this. A couple of a couple of small portable um, switches. For those of you like me who aren't really aware that these things even exist, okay, this hmm. is a switch. It's a switch. It's got lots of holes in the back. These, ports. I believe, are ports, <laughs> and they are Ethernet ports, okay? Yes. Um, Alan, just tell me quickly, what actually is this, and what does it do? Well, most modern routers nowadays come with about three Ethernet ports. Right. And the average smart home has more and more devices now that are internet-enabled. Wi-Fi is great. We love Wi-Fi. It's absolutely brilliant. But if you want the best signal, if you want the strongest signal, if you want the highest security, if you, if you want the most stable connection, then wired is the way to go. And we have a saying here, which is um, wire if you can. I mean, okay. it's not a prophetic statement. It doesn't mean, but if you can run a cable, run a cable because it will give you the best. Stable. The best, most stable internet. So basically, this is just provides you with better, more stable internet yes. access, and for multiple devices. Yes. Brilliant. Yes. Okay. So that's the that's the eight port version that you have there. If you if you open up the box, there's the five port version. Can I just say version? how much I like the handy smallness of this? It's very cute. It looks about the same size of, as an iPhone. It, it, it is indeed. We, we we come with one prepared. So the eight the eight port switch is this side. This is the iPhone 12 Mini. Um, so I can put the iPhone on top and it's very much the same size. So um, if you open the box to this new little product, yep. is this new? Fairly new. Fairly new, yes. Okay, fairly great. New. Yeah. You've yeah. got a quick start guide so you can follow these instructions to set up or you can just watch this video and it'll be much easier. Well, you don't need a quick start guide for this at all. It's totally plug and play. Okay, So you amazing. literally plug it into the wall, plug it into the computer um, via an internet port and away you go. So we've got a power adapter yes. and and the product. the product, and that's it. Yeah. This is super cute. I just <laughs> want you to know that it's quite heavy. It feels good quality, weighty. Yes, and it's, it's tiny. It, it's got metal. It's got metal housing, um, but the product is kept at the lower cost because the ports are plastic. So it doesn't it doesn't make um, that much. Um, difference but it does help us save on cost to provide a, an option with plastic ports we have a metal switch with metal ports as well which costs slightly more than this and it's slightly larger but like if you're just someone like me who just maybe needs to plug in a few extra devices and it isn't yeah. it doesn't really matter like and i just want something cheap this yep. is good it's absolutely right? perfect so if we if you put Five. that next to the iphone 12 mini you can see the difference in size there it's the, teeny the iPhone, tiny. The iPhone dwarfs it in terms of size. So it's, it, it's it's a really little device that you can slot anywhere, behind the TV, next to your router, and you, you, you won't notice it's You can literally there. put that in your back pocket. Yeah. It's really handy. I like it. Once you've plugged your bits and bobs in, what, mm. what, what, what next? What does it actually do? As we talked about wired, wired connections are better than Wi-Fi connections. So they provide you with um, less interference, more stability of, of, of your signal. Mm. So each one of these eight ports in this switch and all five ports mm. in this switch will provide you with a gigabit um, connection. So at home, uh, you, you can plug in your um, various devices around your home entertainment system, okay, for instance. Right. So you've got you've got three slots on your router. You plug this into one. You've got two left, but then you've got seven ports to plug in: laptop, PS5, media streaming uh, uh, center, yeah. Skybox, TV, okay. um, Blu-ray disc player. All of the things that we take for granted now, and some of those things will be. Um, on Wi-Fi at the mm. moment in, in your house, unless you have a switch that will give you these extra ports. Yeah. Wire them up and you will see uh, a definite improvement in terms of um, latency for gamers mm. and streaming. You won't see the... I mean, I don't even anymore. think people really realize that these exist. 
Because I mean, I didn't, and this is very handy and sounds like a very good idea. How much are we talking about in terms of cost for these and where are they available to buy? The the DGS 105 um, is available for around 12 pounds on Amazon. It's 12 absolute, pounds! absolute bargain. And the DGS 108 GL, um, it kind of varies in price a little bit. At the moment, I think it's about 20, 20 pounds on Amazon. So That's insanely cheap. Both are, both, both are bargain. Why are people not buying these things i mean that's that's more my question we sell quite a few so people are, are buying them but I, just not right, everybody okay. doesn't know we okay. obviously yeah. make this video to get the word <laughs> out there about these products and, and let Perfect. more people know they're available these are great i like them very much whatever mm. bits of office we've got so talking about the um usb-c hub oh, so another yeah, thing fantastic. that can make your working from home experience a lot more reliable is something like a usb-c hub Mm. This is the Dub M810. This has the eight connections on it, and Sophie has the Dub M610 there, which has six connections on okay. it. Okay. So there's a there's a whole variety of these products which vary from a four in one version up to the eight in one version, which is the top of the range. Okay. So as you can see on here, there's um, there's a number of ports, um, USB free. Um, you, there's there's a power delivery port there, which can deliver. Um, charge to a device such as a uh, iPad or okay. iPhone. Um, it's compatible with Thunderbolt 3 okay. um, or USB-C, which, okay. which will deliver the power. Okay. And you can see on the other side, we've got SD card readers. We've got um, two more USB 3.0s, which are always useful, especially in an ultra, power, um, ultra portable laptop or a Mac, which don't come with very many ports at all. Okay. And then the pièce de résistance here is an RJ45 or Ethernet, which again, as I just mentioned, a lot of ultra portables and Macs don't come with. So okay. you don't, on new Macs for a study, you don't have a Ethernet connection available as such. So yeah, no, I get don't one of have these, one of mine, no. Get one of these devices, plug it into USB-C port, and, and, and you can power everything via it. And, who, and what kind of people are buying these kinds of things? What, who, who is this really good for? Um, anybody working from home, yeah. this will make it more like an, an office, office experience environment. for you. Because yeah. who, who doesn't, the first thing you do when you walk into your office is plug in your phone. Yeah. Uh, you, you then need a port for your mouse. You, yeah. you, you then need a port for um, anything else that, that, that comes along. So all of those different devices. And mm. what you find when you work from home is you don't have the big expensive docking stations which cost upwards of 150 pounds these usb c devices take up a lot less space and they're a lot less expensive and you literally just plug it from here that's the usb c port so yeah. plug that into the usb c port on your laptop but what if you don't have a usb c port if you have an older laptop we have some usb a ports okay. which um, usb a is the the, the original the, the, the original usb yeah. so the usb yeah. size there okay cool we have a range of those um, for instance we have a usb it's called the dub h7 and it has seven usb ports on it and okay, it can also great. do power delivery so you okay. can charge up multiple devices at once with that that's product that's great and so if we were going to open the box literally it's just it's just, it's just this right it, it's, it's just the port because quick they start are, guide yeah again you don't really need the quick start guide these products are just total plug and play you just plug it in and, and it will work it's very you. snazzy it's a very snazzy silver color yes yes i like it yes there this it one is. this one this one's used so it's not as christine as, as as that one but um it's very handy isn't you, it you can see there it's a it's a high and what are we talking about type. cost wise for these the, the cost varies on the model so we'll have um the cost will start at around thirty pounds for a four in one. Okay. Um, and this product is fifty five pounds for the eight in one, and okay. the others are various iterations in between that. Mm. So if you only need a five in one, a six in one, the the beauty of this is they have so many different connections on them. You can just yeah. pick and choose. So if it's you don't really need, handy, isn't it? Yeah. If you don't need an RJ forty five buy the model without the RJ45. If you don't yeah. need an SD card reader, buy the model without the SD card reader. So you, so you can, can find what you need. You can mix and, mix and match as per yeah. your requirements. I love this. So mm. we're looking at 33, around 30 to, to 50-ish. Yeah, around 30 to, to, to 55 and available pounds the on Available on Amazon and all other retailers. Good retailers. Good retailers, yes. Okay, yes. amazing. I love it. I need to get some. I actually need one of those badly. Yeah. Because can I take that one? Uh, no, that's mine. <laughs> Can I take that one? 
No, it's mine. Ah! <laughs> and that's it for home office accessories, although I'm sure we'll have lots more in the future. We have a massive range, but obviously we, we couldn't show everything in the, in, in, in the video today. So um, check out our shop on Amazon or check out uh, any other good e-tailer that stocks D-Link and you can see the full range out there. And don't hesitate to give us a buzz if you need any further information on these. Thank you. Bye now. Bye.